Welcome to the D'Agostini Cake Decorating Collection. This DVD is designed to show you some of the basic skills demonstrated in each issue of Cake Decorating, where you'll learn to create extraordinary cakes. Once you're comfortable with the fundamental decorating techniques highlighted in every issue, you'll be amazed at the professional looking cakes you can achieve that will delight your family and friends. Fondant is a smooth, sweet, edible confection with a dough-like consistency that can be easily tinted with food coloring to create any color you desire. It makes an excellent cake covering, like on the Fun Circles cake in Issue 1. Before covering a cake with fondant, crumb coat the cake. Take fondant and knead it until it's soft and pliable. Sprinkle a nonstick surface and your rolling pin with a little confectioner's sugar. Roll out the fondant until it is between 1 8 and 1 quarter inch thick. You can use fondant spacers to help you roll it out evenly. Lift and turn the fondant occasionally to prevent it from sticking. Use the rolling pin and your palm to lift the fondant and center it over the cake so it lays loosely over the top. Use your hands to gently smooth the fondant all around, being careful not to leave fingerprints. Next, use a cake smoother to push out any air bubbles on top and around the sides. If you get an air bubble, use a pin or scriber tool to pop it and then smooth over the fondant again. When the fondant is completely smooth, use a sharp knife or pizza cutter to trim away the excess around the base of the cake. See Issue 5 for step-by-step -step instructions. You can use this same basic technique to cover other cake shapes also shown in Issue 5 with a few minor adjustments. To cover a square cake, roll the fondant out into a square shape that's large enough to cover the top and sides of the cake with a little extra that will be trimmed off. Drape the fondant loosely over the top of the cake and use your hands to smooth the fondant, removing any air bubbles. Next, fluff the excess fondant all around the cake and begin smoothing around the sides of the cake, continuing around all four sides, including the corners. Use your other hand to fluff and loosen the fondant as you work your way around. Use a cake smoother to smooth around the sides of the cake and then trim away the excess fondant with a sharp knife or pizza cutter. If the fondant tears, you can patch it with fresh fondant and smooth over it until it blends in. You can use this method for covering other shapes as well. We encourage you to interact with us through our social media sites on Facebook, Pinterest, and Twitter, and share your creations with our community. And please visit our website, mycakedecorating.com. We can't wait to see your successes.